In this tutorial, I will explain a diagonal scale problem. The given data is a drawing area is given as 144 cm square and actual area is 9 km square. So to find the RF value, convert these areas into lengths. Take the square root for the numerator and denominator, then 12 cm and 3 km are the lengths. Now convert the kilometer into millimeters, centimeter into millimeters. After simplification, RF value is 4 by 10 to the power of 5. And maximum length given in the problem is 5 kilometers. From RF and maximum length, the length of the scale is obtained as 200 mm. And the units that are to be represented on this scale are kilometers, hectometers and decameters. Here three units are given. So diagonal scale can be used to represent all these three given units. The value to be marked on the scale is 3.56 kilometers. The meaning of 3.56 kilometers is 3 kilometers, 5 hectometers and 6 decameters. To start the drawing, first take the length of the scale. So this is the length of the scale obtained. Using this length of the scale, first draw a line. That line has to be divided into some number of equal parts. Further observe this maximum length and the bigger unit among these three units. The bigger unit is kilometers. Maximum length is 5 kilometers. If you divide the 200 mm long line into 5 equal parts and each part is kilometer, the maximum length of 5 kilometers can be shown on this scale. So, draw a line of 200 mm length as shown here. Call this as some AB. So, here on this line you will get kilometers and hectometers. Now, divide this into 5 equal parts as shown here. This is 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. Then take 50 mm height, construct the rectangle, draw the vertical lines. Now this length is 1 km. To get hectometers, divide this into 10 equal parts because 10 hectometers equal to 1 km. So divide this into 10 equal parts by taking inclined line method. So these are the 10 equal parts. So take the 10 equal parts on the top side also. Here also you take 10 equal parts. Now draw the lines joining 0 to 1. Diagonal lines, inclined lines you have to draw. So 0 to 1, one inclined line. Then 1 to 2. Here it is 1, here it is 2. Draw a line joining 1 and 2. Similarly, 2 to 3, 3 to 4, 4 to 5, 5 to 6, 6 to 7, 7 to 8, 8 to 9, 9 to 10. In this way draw the inclined lines. Now the, divide this 50 height into 10 equal parts to get decameters. Because 10 decameters equal to 1 hectometer. Divide this into 10 equal parts like this. This is first division 1. Draw a horizontal line passing through 1. Then 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Last one is 10. Now to represent the given value that is 3 kilometers and 5 hectometers and 6 decameters. So 3 kilometers take somewhere here, somewhere here initially, then 5 hectometers will be somewhere here. From 5 hectometers along this inclined line take 6 decameters. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now draw the line joining these two points. That means the line joining MN 
he is representing the given length this is the required line draw the extension lines then draw a dimension line and write the dimension note as 3.56 kilometers